You know, some religions think that the egg is the symbol of the soul. Did you know that? No, I didn't know that. In his book on writing, Sol Stein, the famous writer and editor, suggests that writers can enrich the stories through resonance, the sense that something has significance beyond its physical boundaries. My name is Ishmael and I hail from Bethlehem, for example, strikes a religious tone through its biblical resonance. Visual metaphors involving objects, places and actions too connote something over and above their denotative meaning, soliciting emotions and ideas that resonate with readers and audiences. They typically form part of an image system that supports the story's hidden meaning while simultaneously being part of the mise en scene. I'm Dr. Stavros Halvatsis, writer, lecturer, and story consultant. Visual metaphors take many forms. The breaking of a chain may represent the onset of freedom. A broken mirror might represent the theme of illusion and deception, or a shattered persona. Shakespeare often uses visual metaphors to deepen the story's meaning. The rain in King Lear, who is reduced to mad rumblings stemming from the betrayal of his daughters, symbolizes his inner turmoil. He's figuratively and literally cast out into the storm. In Macbeth, the murder of King Duncan and the usurping of his throne upsets the balance of nature. The land, caught up in the conflict, is visually portrayed as descending into a kind of hell, bathed in flames. This foreshadows the real hell that awaits Macbeth upon his death at the hands of Macduff. In Angel Heart, Louis Cipher, or Lucifer, offers Private Eye Harry Angel an egg, which Harry refuses to take. Would you like an egg? No, thank you. Were Harry to have accepted the egg, he would have taken back his soul, in effect terminating the story. Instead, Harry, at a symbolic level, offers up his soul to be consumed by the devil. One of the most persistent visual metaphors in film and literature is the pairing of food with sex. Who can forget this scene from When Harry Met Sally, when the two potential lovers flirt around plates of food. The food metaphor represents the hunger, real or figurative, that lovers have for each other's bodies. Oh! 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 Oh, God! Oh! In the piano, Baines painstakingly dusts the instrument. But he's not just cleaning an object. His actions represent the caresses he wishes to bestow on his lover. Visual metaphors need to be carefully constructed, though. Consuming a salad would not work as well as eating a spoonful of cream. Dusting a piano with a rag would not be as effective as a naked Baines wiping the instrument with his shirt. But crafted well, metaphors deepen and enrich meaning, leaving us with an indelible impression of the story. Well, that's it for now. If you've gained value from this video, hit that subscribe button and add a comment to help the channel grow. See you soon.